This video shows the initial measurements that you will need to take prior to the predation of the specimen. Each group will be provided with an odometer cell, which you will need to disassemble first. You can start by unscrewing the two round nuts that hold the positioning ring in place. Take the positioning ring out of the odometer cell and this will provide access to the rigid odometer ring. Take the odometer ring out. Note that it has a sharpened edge at the top. Next, take the ball and top cap out. Then, you will be left with the top porous plate and the larger bottom porous plate. Take a moment to identify the components of the odometer cell. Measure and record the internal diameter of the odometer ring by using a vernier caliper. Take at least three measurements for the diameter at three different orientations. These measurements will be averaged to determine the internal diameter of the odometer ring. In the same way, measure the height of the odometer ring. These measurements will be used to calculate the initial volume of the specimen. Measure and record the mass of the ring. Later, you will need to determine the mass of the specimen that will be held by the ring. Measure and record the combined mass of the top porous plate, top cap, and the ball. This will be the initial weight that will be acting on the specimen prior to the application of load increments. You will be provided with three metal containers that will be used for collecting clay samples for the determination of moisture content of the specimen. You will need to label the containers and measure the mass of each one separately. 